quick video. I'll keep it short. So um, if you've been watching the videos, you know that we put our broilers here out. We have uh, 300 of them here. We put them out on Saturday. And Saturday evening, we did not get freezing temperatures. Last night, so Sunday night, we got got down to like 28 degrees and um, it froze. There was frost all over this pasture here. Um, it gets much colder here than it does over at the home farm a few miles that way, a couple degrees colder. And so, let me turn this around, if it will let me. There we go. So we switched the waterers out here. We have Plasson waters, gravity fed from a five gallon pail. P-L-A-S-S-O-N, if you wanna look them up. I came out here at, if you can see the layer shelter over there, I did a live video on that if you wanna check that out. Uh, I came to open up their nest box so they could start laying eggs this morning at about 545 and I checked the waterers and I'll hop in here closer so you can see exactly what this looks like. Try not to scare the hens here. So as you can see, here's the water. The water in the, uh, the lip there was frozen solid this morning. Solid at six o'clock. So I'm assuming all the line was frozen as well, which it logically must have been. But I knew from the day before when we put these shelters out to put the chickens in that the frost came off the field at about eight o'clock and started to warm up. So I was hoping that the sun would warm up the system. As you can see, it's hitting each drinker uh, as the sun comes up over the horizon over there. And it did. So they're all thought out, they're all functioning. And as you can see, there is ice in the bucket still. Um, there's maybe an eighth of an inch of ice there. So, it, I mean, it got cold and everything here froze. Some water in the bucket froze, the line froze, that froze solid. They're thawed out now and they're all working very well. So that's reassuring. We are here in Northern Michigan and this weather is not uncommon. It's a little colder than usual, but you can expect below freezing temperatures well into um, May. I forgot what month it was. So if you're looking into getting a plas on and you're in a northern, more northern climate, um, at a glance, after a freezing night, last night you guys saw the ice, um, they're still functioning well. They have thawed out, it's like 8.40, 8.45 right now. And all the drinkers have thawed out. You can see that there are, hold on, let me switch the camera around again. They are crowding it a little bit, all right? So now that they realize that it is thawed out, this one not so bad, um, but they might crowd them a little bit but it hasn't caused any issues so far. So, class on water update. Works pretty good. Um, I'll keep you updated. I could not find a lot of on the ground examples, videos of it working in our climate. Um, so I wanted to make this available to you guys so that you're aware of its upsides and downsides. So, all right, that's it. Just wanted to show you guys what's up. Um, keep farming or get farming. You don't need to be a farmer to farm. Hey, anyone can farm. Mark Baker, there you go. All right, we'll see you guys later.